Hi, I'm Anthony from Extra Technology. Welcome to another how-to video for Autosys. Today, we're going to look at ways of improving your workflows, making them more transparent and easier to support. We will use a few of the job types available in Autosys to do this. Let's look at our imaginary Autosys job. There are a few important things to know about this job. It's been running every day for several years. It's a command job and it calls a large script. The script performs several steps. And finally, this job is absolutely critical. It must succeed or the business will suffer. The large script mentioned earlier carries out the following steps. Step 1. It polls a certain directory looking for a file. Step 2. When the file appears, it checks for a string of text in the file. Step 3. The script uses a SQL client to check a value in a database table. Step 4. The file is copied to a different directory where it gets processed through a different program. Step 5. The copied file is sent by FTP to a different server. Step 6. The output from the FTP session is checked for errors. And Step 7. The original file is deleted. Although this is just an example, this type of script-based processing is common. But there are a number of problems, and here are some of them. The script is large and it's quite complicated. Because of this, any failure usually results in a call out to a developer to have a look. If it fails at any point, rerunning things from the point of failure is quite tricky. The script has database and FTP user IDs and passwords written inside it in plain text. And the FTP server at the receiving end of the transfer sometimes get stuck. Now let's see how we could improve this by adding in some different job types. We add a file trigger job that makes sure the directory where our file will arrive is empty. We add another file trigger job that checks when the file is created and when it reaches a certain size. We add a text file monitoring job that looks in the received file for the string that we need. We add a database job that needs no database client and no visible credentials to check the value in a database table. We add a command job to copy the file. We add, we add an IP monitoring job that makes sure the target FTP server is working. We add an FTP job to transfer the file and check the successful transfer. And we add a command job to delete the file at the end. Here's what the new job flow might look like. Before we had one job running a single, complex, fragile and hard to support script. It could stall or fail at any point and it had embedded usernames and passwords inside it. Now we have a flow of jobs where everyone can see exactly how far the process has got. It is secure and much more robust. By using different job types available in Autosys, we have improved the quality and robustness of this critical process, which directly benefits our business. Thank you for viewing this video. For more information, please email us at info at extratechnology.com or visit our website www.extratechnology.com.